On Mercury, the Sun appears as a large ball of fire in the sky. It is hard to believe that this small planet, despite its difficult location, has been able to build up such a rich and very geological history. Imagine setting off on a helicopter flight over Mercury as we fly over this fascinating landscape. The first thing we notice is the surface, which is covered in craters. These craters are witnesses to countless collisions with meteorites and asteroids and tell the story of a long past with many impacts. Mercury has almost no atmosphere, which means that it's exposed to the interplay and temperature differences between day and night. Probes have tried to get very close to this fascinating planet several times, but reaching and landing on Mercury is an enormous technical challenge. Its proximity to the Sun is a major problem, and its immense gravitational pull requires space probes that can navigate to resist the Sun's pull and instead head for tiny Mercury and enter a stable orbit. Mercury's weak gravity makes this a feat. It's difficult to gently set a probe down on the surface without it crashing or bouncing too hard. All these factors combined make Mercury missions one of the most challenging undertakings in space travel. Added to this is the extreme heat. Space probes exploring Mercury must be built to withstand the high temperatures. This requires the use of special heat shields and careful planning of the mission to minimize solar radiation. What do we know so far? In the world of the gods, Mercury is the celestial messenger, and fittingly NASA sent its own messenger to this enigmatic planet. Messenger stands for Mercury surface, space environment, geochemistry, and ranging. With this groundbreaking mission, NASA achieved the feat of keeping an orbiter stable in Mercury's orbit for many years. Launched in August 2004, the probe reached the closest planet to the Sun in March 2011. After a complex journey of swing by maneuvers around Earth, Venus and Mercury itself, it was the first time that a space probe had entered a stable orbit around Mercury. Messenger's four-year mission was absolutely worthwhile and brought incredible discoveries. Who would have thought, for example, that water ice could exist on such a hot planet? But that's exactly what the messenger confirmed. The probe found water ice in the permanently shadowed craters at Mercury's poles. This was definitely one of the most spectacular discoveries that revolutionized our idea of Mercury and possible conditions for water in the solar system. Messenger further revealed unexpectedly dynamic aspects of Mercury, signs of volcanic activity and a complex geologic past. The mission ended in April 2015, when the probe ran out of fuel and crashed into the planet in a controlled maneuver, breaking up on its surface. Before Messenger began its journey, other probes had already visited Mercury, albeit not with the same range and depth of investigation. The first of these was Mariner 10, which flew past Mercury three times between 1974 and 1975, providing the first images. It's hard to imagine, but before Mariner 10, we had no idea what Mercury really looked like. The probe provided the first close-up images of the Mercury surface and discovered its weak magnetic field, a discovery no one had expected at the time. Researchers had previously assumed that Mercury could not have its own magnetic field due to its small size and slow rotation. After Messenger, Bay Colombo is now taking over the legacy. The joint mission of the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Japanese Space Agency, JSA, is currently on its long journey to Mercury. Launched in October 2018, this mission will solve the remaining mysteries of Mercury, and in particular, investigate Mercury's magnetic field and its geological history and surface composition in detail. One of these researchers' most fascinating goals is to investigate the mysterious hollows on Mercury. These are small, irregular depressions that have been discovered on the surface of the planet 
and whose formation is still a mystery. The mission will also try to find out more about the unusual inclination of Mercury's magnetic field and why it is so strongly shifted compared to other planets. The arrival of baby Columbo in Mercury's orbit is planned for the end of 2025. The exploration of Mercury will not only help us to understand this single planet, every new discovery about planets in the solar system completes our knowledge of the formation and development of the entire solar system. Mercury could have once been somewhere else in the solar system and was probably pushed further and further inwards by the gravity of the gas giants. This game is still measurable at the moment, and it's possible that Mercury will eventually be pushed into the Sun by Jupiter, or that poor little Mercury will be pushed out of the solar system altogether. However, researchers do not see this scenario happening for many millions of years. The Mariner 10 mission, which visited Mercury in the 1970s, revealed this cater landscape for the first time. Later, the Messenger mission provided even more detailed images. We next see the so-called hollows, which are flat, irregular depressions which clearly differ from the typical craters. As our imaginary flight continues, we recognize the huge plains as evidence of past volcanic activity. It is hard to imagine what these smooth, vast plains could once have been covered by magmatic oceans. Messenger found many clues to this volcanic history, including the composition of the surface, which is rich in magnesium and poor in iron. Further on again, we marvel at the long cliffs known as roots, which stretch for hundreds of kilometers. These impressive structures are probably the result of the planet shrinking as it cooled and solidified. Messenger's observations confirmed that Mercury has shrunk over time. At the poles, we can see the craters, which probably contain large amounts of water ice. Despite its proximity to the sun and extreme surface temperatures, messengers found evidence of this ice. The discovery was revolutionary and once again raised completely new questions about the path of water in our solar system. Our fictional flight over Mercury revealed a plane full of contrasts and mysteries. Mercury is a world that intoxicates our senses and is a truly breathtaking and rich world so close to the sun you might also think that a small planet exposed to such extreme conditions would only offer a barren chart landscape, but that is not the case. Mercury is exciting, and who wouldn't want to explore these landscapes for themselves? The Mercury surface is not only an archive of cosmic impacts, but also a testimony to complex internal processes. The large flat plains could originate from lava flows that once emerged from the planet's interior the discoveries of the various Mercury missions have continued to complete our picture of this planet, and each mission has simultaneously raised new mysteries. What are your thoughts about Mercury? Comment your thoughts down below. Like and share this video with your space enthusiasts to educate them about these details. And subscribe to our channel for more similar space educational videos. See you in the next best video. Until then, Thank you for watching this video until the end.